man, that's so much to read. Trophy, you collect and bone charts. There are so many. Field survey notes, the royal spy. effects slightly improved breath capacity in water breaking glass sounds okay moderate keyhole peeping magnification drop assassination I got some health swim enemy miss more often with arrows and bolts win sword versus sword contest more frequently White rest can be consumed for mana. White rats won't attack you. How many do I have? Okay. Lungs, no. Hmm. That's a lot. Okay, I got everything around here. There is a coin down. Yeah, I got a coin. Let's check what's here. Should I clear space for Samuel then? If you like, but he won't use it. Why? He can't sleep in regular beds anymore, but that's what he says. He says he was in the Navy too long. Can you believe it? Oh. That pile of wood out there? It's a hobble he built from an old rowboat. Where does Admiral Havelock bring these people, I wonder? Attention, Dunwall citizens. Be it. The river crust in Nation has spread downriver. As far as the river mouth and flood. Corvo seems to have arrived in good shape. To approach or Much better than I expected, given what I've seen in Coleridge Prison. From doing so. He seems the willing to work with us, and he shouldn't lack for motivation. The man has lost everything. We'll judge how he performs in the field. And if I can, I'll find a way to test him personally. Okay.
Pendleton Memoirs, Chapter 27. In my thirteenth year, the despised stepmother at last departed, and Pendleton Hall was again quiet. Although father had by then sunk into deep depression, it was at this sensitive time that Waverly Boyle first entered my life. She who will be the source of many tender recollections to come. Da. Da. One second. Okay, I am back. Attention, citizens. Okay. Dunwall. The old port district has been added to the evacuation list. The Weaver count for the month of seeds has increased. The Lord Regent has decreed that plague ordinances will remain in effect through the month of rain. Stay alert and stay So many books to read. There is a rune. Let's jump and try to get that. Someone is eating me. Play your way powers. The powers you obtain from runes can be used creatively to defeat enemies or move through the environment. Blink from roof to roof, possess rats and fish, or slow time before rushing a group of enemies. And now I can learn to have more health. Yeah, why not? You have an extended health bar. And regenerate more faster. Thank you. Okay. I just complete the optional step. Somewhere in the basements below. There is nothing else around here. Oh my god, the water is so deep. Let's use my blink. And this. Oh, nice. Oh, I can go there. Oh, 
Oh, really? Really? Thank you. Now let's go to the Admiral. First time chat, Posh, Posh, she's, if I say that correctly, thank you so much for lurking. Admiral is right well, here. Let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business, but sometimes good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Camel dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Hell Pits. Okay, so I have... Two missions. Eliminate High Overseer Campbell. Travel with Samuel to the boatman to your first mission. Take the Black Major from High Overseer Campbell. Okay. Mission close. Mission items. No. Bone charms and the inventory. Now I have to speak again with Pierre first if I remember his location. It's somewhere oh, here. Corvo? If you've a moment. Yes. Hello. Corvo. Hello, I'm Callista. I work Callista. here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer, that wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me, but my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison, and I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Mission clues? Callista has an uncle who is a captain of the Dunwall City Watch. Captain Kerno is a decent man trying to make the best of a corrupt regime and and not change from within. He is meeting much resistance. That's an optional. Ensure Captain Carno survives his visit to the office of the High Overseer. Oh man. That's something. And where is my...
What can I do for you? What can you do? Some upgrades, please. Bullet capacity. Bone char capacity. <laughs> Let's buy that one. Let's let's get the not so expensive ones. Range for my crossbow, and I only have makes the sword more effective when locking blades and pushing against an enemy. Let's learn the reload and that's all with my coins. This door is open. And let's go. Ready to go? Just give the signal. Yeah, yeah. Let's go then. Take me to the distillery district. And that's my mask. I'm the mask. Mission clues. High Overseer Campbell is the city's militant religious faction and is a close ally to the Lord Regent. Campbell is completely corrupt and holds the secret of to Emily's location, infiltrate the office of the High Overseer, steal Campbell's journal and eliminate him. An ally to the Loyalist, Martin is being held there. Free Martin and allow him to escape. Oh yeah, but first I have to see where is this captain. be a rough trip. Used to be to go straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. The City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. I don't know which is worse. Just take your pick. Okay, the city watch holds Clavering Boulevard beyond the first wall of light. The Bottle Street gang controls the side streets around Clavering Boulevard. Granny Rex lives in an apartment at the far end of Endoria Street. Man, so many missions. Get past the first wall of light. Optional, use the Bottle Street alleys to get around the walls of light. Yeah, I have to speak with Granny. Granny, where are you? So there's no map. No, there's no map for this game. Can I save? Yes. Let's create a save. Let's go. It's nearly midnight. But eat. Bone charms. Rune. 
There are two runes and one bone charm in this. Oh, and there is a bone charm there too. Okay. Oh. Charm, not the rune. Let's get that. So I can jump up. But why? Why, why, why? Okay, you climb slightly faster, breaking glass south is moderately reduced, swim, yeah, let's put this here, oh, I have another one, delicate, okay, nice. here Attention, watch this oh. district is now considered a highly infected area. Residents are to be escorted to adjacent neighborhoods or delivered for immediate deportation to the flooded district. Remain in position until qualified personnel have completed the removal of infected bodies. Many 
granny, granny, oh. come with me instead. Here granny, is granny. Granny, granny, you can't because you're... Oh, where are you? Oh, this one is down here. I told you the knives go on the left. They've always gone on the left. You never listen. Can I go there? This is the front, yeah, the front door. I told you the knives go on the left. They always. Dear? Is that you, my dear husband? Uh, my eyes aren't what they used to be. Have you seen my little birdies? Ah, oh, the dear things must be starving without their granny. Here, birdies. Here. Oh, my, my, my. I think I have gentlemen callers again, but not the way I used to, not the nice ones. I hear them, and they're not very polite ones either. Granny rags, granny rags, let us in. Ah, oh, well, they'll go away again if they know what's good for them. What a bother. Use the key to the front door, love. You'll see to those ruffians, won't you? What? I have to deal. Oh no, that's not a nice thing. Just garbage. Garbage, 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 garbage. All of it. Let us in, Granny. I bet she can't even hear us. She's blind. We're here to do your washing. She's not stupid either. Have it your way. We're here to take your money, Granny. We're wasting our time. How much could she have? She digs in trash for a living. Let's get a drink. I'm dry as an overseer's prick. She's been digging for 80 years. <laughs> Come on, let's get her. Yeah, something like that. Granny, granny, granny. granny. They are oh, so dead. My dear, I knew you'd help me with those ill mannered boys. My brave man. Listen, Granny has a birthday present for you. I got oh, it from the outside, my birthday. and now I'm giving it to you. Go on. It's upstairs. On the vanity. I think you'll cut a nice figure.